Kielbasa to the pack. It is pack here. AKA your mama's best friend. And in today's video, I am going over the farthest green lights made of NBA 2K21 so far. See, I'm only going to be able to talk about the current generation of 2K21 for so long. Like, we only have a month left. I might as well do this video now, right? This was actually my most popular video ever back in 2K19. And then 2K20, you couldn't green past half court. But this year, you can kind of green sometimes. So, I made this video again. Now, before this video starts, though, be an OG, join the pack, and subscribe, and clarification. So, I am measuring exactly where they shoot and telling you the feet based off an NBA court. NBA courts are 94 feet in length, so that's what we're going by. I understand that the park is a shorter court than an NBA court, but last time I measured it according to which park and NBA court, people got mad. So, I'm literally doing it by every single court is measured by nba court standards okay so no matter what i know the park courts are short are like shorter but people care more about the length in between like how it looks lengthwise okay so that's what i'm basically basing it off just wanted to clarify that before we start this video okay let's get this video started starting this list off at number 10. okay so this one he's using Kawhi leonard in prelude and the reason why i have these at number 10 nine and eight so these are basically honorable mentions these are not legit ones but i think they're so crazy that i want to talk about this is 85 feet long okay Kawhi leonard using the pro stick is greening at full court you cannot do this at least anymore from my understanding i have not seen anybody be able to hit full square shots at number nine coming up the same thing Kawhi leonard in prelude another person doing it hitting it even farther this one is at 88 feet i have these as orange because these are asterisks because these are not in game these are in practice and i have not seen anybody else pull this off so which means they're probably patched and you can't be doing this anymore well we'll see in a second but as you can see here though these are ridiculously long and, and crazy effort and i'm surprised they could pull this off anyways but still at number eight it's the final one of these these are the asterisk ones but this is the official farthest shot ever look how crazy this is he's using patrick beverly this is even farther than 100 feet he is as far i mean this is as far as possible in the game you cannot get farther than this this is the the record but again this was not in game this was not online this was not legit so i don't have this in the official list just because these weren't really made in game so i can't really really consider these plus this is on the prelude before patch so it, it's it's kind of hard to put those in but here we go at number seven here are some legit ones this one's in wreck the dude's like i'll hit a half court green in the wreck why not he literally hits it just in front of the half court but it's on the logo right in front of the line I mean, it was the end of the game, so he was like, why not? Berg with the crazy shot. 45 feet legit. Of course, because he had takeover, because that takeover is broken. But still, he was able to do it. And low-key, it was kind of contested. I mean, the guy kind of put his shot, like, hand up, but it was wide open. But still, the fact that he was able to green that in wreck, pretty ridiculous. At number six on the list, here we go. Here's another legit one. Elements for real is like, I'll green it while this dude's doing a backflip. I mean, bro. I know you're doing a backflip and everything, and I know—I mean, yeah, you are blowing them out, but he's going to hit these. I mean, that is a little past full court. Now, here's the thing. It's a little past half court, and people do do these. Like, it's not like it's impossible. I had this one at about 46 feet and 6 inches just because it was a little bit, like, barely in front of the half court line, but still. Look, I know these aren't the rarest things, and people do these all the time, but in the clips I found online, this was one of the longest ones I was able to find. Now, at number 5 on the list, here we go with Lucas McCaesar, and he's a little past half court, and he's like, shit, I'll green it, and it turned into a galaxy, because he was, he was literally mixtape editing that one, but bro, with TakeOver, past half court, about 49 feet back, was able to green it, and hit a ridiculous shot for game, by the way, and this is the crazy part, they weren't guarding him, because it was game point, it was a serious game, he's behind half court, they're like, we're not gonna guard this dude, he's so far away, and then he still hit it for game, that's crazy, at number four on the list, y'all ready? Yeah. Leave me open, leave me open, no, leave me open, bro, leave me open. Leave me open. Leave me open. I'm not leaving no. you open. Leave me open, I'll leave you open next game, I'll leave you open next game. This is what you got for face guarding me, this is what you got for face guarding me. Whoa. 
Oh my gosh, these squeakers. I swear, squeakers always have the craziest highlights in these videos, but ah, oh, my ears, I'm sorry about that one. But bro, this dude hits a fadeaway green. A little, okay, so here's the thing. It wasn't in the middle of half court, so it's even farther. He was at half court and he faded away on the side of half court, so it's even farther than what half court is. So it's about 49 feet he did at takeover. I mean, I don't even know what that name is, just a bunch of eyes and a dash, but he did do this pretty dang far. I know this isn't the exact measurement, but yeah, he still hits a half court shot fade away really far away. It's crazy that he hit that. At number three on the list, these are the ones that are pretty dang far. This dude is in the park. This is the farthest park shot made. He is almost outside of the logo doing a behind the back a lot of finesse shows a lot of finesse <coughs> sorry and here and he greens it super far away here's the thing i had this measured at about 50 feet more or less i mean he does this almost outside of the logo just barely has a foot in it and greens it i mean that's easily the farthest park shot i have found so far maybe some of you are like i've hidden farther but online in the internet on youtube this is the only one that i was able to find this far out in the park and still that's a nasty green literally ridiculous that he hit that i mean that one's pretty gross and it was for game and then now at number two on the list this one is the farthest one in pro-am dude hits it outside of the logo on the opponent's three-point line guapo or oh guapo Lily hits this with a 24% chance of making it wide open. Was like, I'll hit this for a game. And dude, I have this measured at 56 feet. That's pretty far out. And he greened it. I mean, dude, at, at the opponent's three-point line, that is unheard of. I, I have not found a single clip online in a 3v3 situation that was farther than this. This is easily the farthest one I have found so far. But at number one, this is the farthest shot official in the game so far. This dude was just playing a play now game and hit with Matumbo a full court shot green. And this one is legit. This was not in the prelude. This was post patch. And even though he was playing with a historic team with old Dikemi Matumbo with basically no three point rating, he was able to green it. 87 inches back underneath the basket basically and this one's legit not a fake one not a like a practice one and this is 2k21 and he was able to green that that is absolutely crazy easily the farthest screen in this game by far like it's not even close and it's just amazing that he was able to do this with matumbo but still it's crazy that is it for this video you guys those are the longest shots of nba 2k21 do you think you have a farther shot that is a green Hey, let me know. Maybe send it to me on my Instagram or Twitter and I might upload it in a brand new video and I might make a brand new version of this because I'm sure some of you can find even farther greens. I'm sure. Okay, but that's it for this video, you guys. If you like this channel, give it a sub and I will see you guys next time. If you want all the latest news of NBA 2K and also NBA in general, you should follow me on my Twitter account at PackHoopsY. Not only that, I do giveaways all the time when it comes to VC, games, and also even consoles. So check it out, follow me, and see you there.